Hey everyone, Omar here for another JavaScript function video. Uh, for this one, we're going to do something a little bit, uh, maybe not complicated, but this requires two steps. What if you have a sentence that has some uh, a bold word or some bold words, and you want to only pull out the bold words? So what we'll do for this is we'll call this only the bold. And we're going to have a sentence we're going to pass in. Now, to pull out certain words, you use the substring um, property. So, for example, sentence dot substring. And then you're going to have a starting point and an ending point in here. But where do you start and where... Oh, let me spell that right. Okay, where do you start and where do you finish? Um, that's when we're going to use index of. So we're going to combine index of and substring together. So let's start with variable start, where we start. And we're going to do an index of. Now, if you remember in JavaScript, and because JavaScript and, uh, sorry, in HTML, HTML and JavaScript kind of work together. So this is the sign for bold in JavaScript. So we'll actually start wherever it starts with this bold tag and we'll end at one, two, three. So we need to use plus three just so it knows start here, just right there. And then we'll end, so we'll have a variable called end. And we'll do the same thing, index of and we'll end wherever there's a closing tag. And you don't actually need any plus or minus for this because as soon as it sees the next little less than sign, it's gonna stop right there. So uh, you don't need any kind of number to let it know where to, exactly where to end. And then now we can come down here to store this in a variable called bold. And we'll start here right where you first see the opening tag for the bold text and then we'll end here right where it has the closing tag for the bold text and then we'll return bold All right and that's it so let's see how that works and only the bold and let's go ahead and ignore that example and say, hey, hey, you, what's your name? And close that. Boom. It only returns, hey, you, because it starts, it, I set it to start where the bold tag begins and to end right here. So it only gets this part right here. If you didn't have that plus three, um, let's go ahead and see how that looks just in case you're curious. This is the best way to learn programming is to try um, and learn from your mistakes. So uh, let's delete all that. Okay, so only the bold and let's do the exactly the same thing what I just did. As you can see it will give you the tag itself. That's why you need the plus three so it actually starts not there, but three spaces after. One, two, three. So it actually starts there. All right, and that's it. That's how you pull out the bold text. So I hope you enjoyed that video, and I'll see you later.